Tonight is opening night for the East Lime Regional Theater in its brand new venue. And now the group needs your help to make that venue a home. Channel 3 New London Bureau Chief Luke Hydash explains. Stad kisses. Get kicked. It is finally lights, camera, action at the new Niantic Bay Playhouse. And we have been traveling from middle school to high school to Masonic lodges and never truly had a home of our own. And you wake, ring for Drake. Drake what was once the Niantic Cinemas has been brought back to life. When you walk the halls, you see the resemblance to the original downtown movie theater. There's new paint on the walls, new pictures in the frames, but one thing hasn't changed. The people coming here are here to be entertained. Around two months ago, we started building the stage, and it's so like cool to see the space transform. This weekend, all the hard work comes to fruition. Pinch me, please! Ow. She Especially for kids it. like Ryan, playing Annie herself. I make so many new friends, and I'm with my theater fam. The theater never had a true home. Now, a decade into entertaining the Connecticut shoreline, that changes. This room sits close to 200, but there's still a long road ahead and more goals to achieve. The more support we get, the more we can in turn do for our community. Like any movie theater, there's more than one cinema room. So far, only one has been fixed up. There's still a few more to get to and equipment isn't cheap. We had to borrow equipment at currently and we're renting our lighting equipment and it's quite costly. And that's why there's a GoFundMe to keep the stage lit and the curtain up at the new Niantic Bay Playhouse. I know I'm gonna like it here. Annie runs April 28th through May 7th. Great. In Niantic. Hard. Luke Hydash, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.